I'm making a plum blackberry and bay leaf friant. It's a nice kind of end of summer, beginning of autumn uh, dish. I'm just going to start by uh, cutting the plums into wedges. So the best way to do that is cut them through the middle and then twist them like that and then get the stone out. And then just kind of like one centimeter wedges. They don't need to be perfect at all. There's all these beautiful fruits there, the blackberries, the plums, the bay leaves, and I'm gonna add a bit of ground cinnamon. Not too much, so it's not too dominant. Some sugar and some vanilla paste. I'm gonna give it all a stir. Essentially what I'm doing is softening the fruit. So the sugar is just gonna start drawing the liquids out, the moisture out, so you get like softer, juicier fruit to go on top of the batter. And that's going to sit for about 30 minutes just to draw out the juices, but not longer than 30 minutes. There's nothing like melting butter. Into uh, this big bowl, I'm going to add some ground almonds and I've got some salt in here as well. Icing sugar, a small amount of flour and some more cinnamon again. Just gonna give it a little mix. It doesn't need to be perfect because I'm gonna add liquids and then everything is gonna come together nicely. So I need about four egg whites. Whatever you do, don't waste the egg yolks. I'm going to uh, use them straight away to make some custard. So I'm just whisking the egg whites, not too long, I'm not making meringue, I just want to get them a little bit frothy. They go straight into the dry ingredients. I'm going to give that a good mix. And then I'll add the melted butter. That's how it needs to be. And this just goes straight in there. You can see that the sugar has taken some of the liquids out of the fruit. Now it's just a case of arranging them on top of the, the batter and you can do that any way you like. You'll see when it bakes, some of the fruit will sink to the bottom and others will stay on top. And any juices that are remaining in the bowls are very welcome to go back onto the fruit. It's just, just so summery and beautiful with the bay leaves and the blackberries. It's perfect. So I'm gonna give that 40 minutes. For the last 10 minutes, I'm just going to cover it with foil so it doesn't get uh, too dark. Ta-da! It's just the smell of fruit and summer and cinnamon. It's beautiful. And I've got here this bowl of cream because that's the best thing to serve with this or ice cream. <laughs>